My name's Jonathan Holmes, I go under the, the gaming name of Jono. Um, I'm currently sat in third in the eSports WRC Championship and my best result would be second in the grand finals of the eSports WRC in Season 2. My nickname is uh, Greek one and uh, I belong to a team, a uh, web eSports uh, team. Uh, powered by First Master. Je m'appelle Nexel, j'ai 20 ans, je suis français. Uh, je suis uh, champion du monde e-sport uh, à la saison 2. J'ai été trois fois finaliste, donc des trois saisons. Et je suis actuellement troisième du championnat de la saison 4. First impressions are actually really good. Um, we can see there's definitely been a, uh, a step up from WRT7, and Carlos Hunt have definitely made a step forward in, in what they've produced. So the new physics model seems fairly good so far. Um, a few obvious new sort of features to it is that there's a lot more sort of drive now in the car. Um, it requires you to require a lot more sort of the car's a lot more responsive um, than it used to be, and sort of going into a hairpin, you now you really need to make use of the handbrake properly um, and to be able to get the drive out of the corner. Biggest improvement. I guess you could say the physics, but that's probably what everybody else has said. So I'm going to say the new tyre model. Um, there's a there's a new sort of tyre deformation model um, where the tyres are scrubbing off during the rally and, and sort of the wearing down over time. And uh, yeah, eventually you, you can end up with punctures and the puncture blows out and, and uh, yeah, then you're left with a pretty shocking car for the rest of the stage. But uh, yeah, no. Uh, my first impression is uh, like a new game. Too many improvements from the last one, the WRC7, and uh, I'm impressed of uh, the graphics of the game. The graphics are perfect. Uh, I'm really impressed uh, about uh, also the weather uh, conditions, uh, rain, uh, storm, uh, how the weather changed. It is really impressed. I think it's the best uh, graphics ever. Yes, I like very much the stages. It is very clean. New stones, new road, uh, the movement of the trees from the air, uh, the rain. Really, I'm very impressed. With all the new rallies, like the Turkey and the Chile, I like a lot. Even if the Turkey is quite hard, but it's really fun to play. It's possible to play a special in one sense and in the other sense. That's why there are a lot of special in the game. On joue beaucoup, nous, les joueurs, surtout en e-sport. Donc on connaît bien ce qui nous dérange ou ce qu'on aime bien. Donc ça rend cool de pouvoir faire des retours aux développeurs. A couple of new, new sort of countries, Turkey and, and Chile, for example. I spent a, a little bit of time this morning playing Turkey, which is a, a very challenging uh, stage or country at least, with a lot, lots of rocks. And uh, yeah, it requires a lot of work and uh, effort. To, to sort of get the car to the finish. But there's, again, there's been a lot of hard work put into the design. We play the game pretty much every day for, for multiple hours. Um, so we know sort of the little tricks here and there. And it, it's good to, to actually be able to give feedback on, on things that are maybe aren't correct. I know we suggested a few things yesterday that could do with a little bit more improvement. So it's, it's nice to actually be able to provide some, some information to, to everybody and, and developers take that on board and uh, implement the fixes or the, or the changes required. It's been nice to be able to sort of test an, an, an alpha version, obviously it's not the complete product, it is an alpha um, version of the game and then we've had a tour around of the studio and sort of sat with the different developers to see what they do to, uh, to produce the game and how every little working team puts all their bits together. Um, to push forward to the, to the overall game. So it's been a good experience and uh, it's nice to sort of see behind the scenes of what happens. I'm in Kiloton studio and uh, I see how the people work and uh, make the game. The game which I'm playing for four years and uh, I'm really happy. Every year, step by step, the game makes better and better and better.